Hello YouTube, this is Bubs Comics coming at you with a quick comic haul. Um, this is, I'm just super happy with this haul, I don't know how to say it. Uh, really happy, let me jump right into it. Um, these are all things I just didn't expect to have in my collection and I'm really happy to have them. So. Uh, here we go, uh, first we have an Action Comics 1 reprint, this is the Loot Crate exclusive. Uh, it's got the COA there, very happy to have that. I already have an Action Comics um, reprint. Uh, it was the, not the Death of Superman, but it was the one with the Death of Superman advertising. I think it's maybe 1983. Um, but really happy to have this one. It's a lot cleaner. It's It's got better color to it. Uh, it has the full reprint of all the Action Comics, not just Superman's story in there. And there's lots of stuff in there. Um, it's really cool. It even has some reprint of a couple of old advertisements. Um, so far, this is my favorite version of the reprints. So, very happy to have that. <clears throat> Here we have <coughs> Strange Tales number two, uh, Werewolf by Night. I uh, already had number one, so really happy to have this one. Um, I can't believe, you know, it's so funny. I found number one a week ago. And then I stumbled upon number two this week, so I guess it was meant to be that I get this Werewolf by Night. I think it's volume two, so I'm really happy with that. Um, here's a book that I have been just, I can't believe I found it. I've been hunting for this book. Um, as, as some of you may remember, I was going to, I am still going to be meeting Kevin Conroy, and I was going to get a signature. It's my understanding his signatures are a little pricey. Uh, he's the voice of Batman and basically everything worth watching uh, so <laughs> and video games too so what I was looking to do he was also the voice for the animated series for Batman the animated series so I've been looking at all kinds of stuff I've been picking up every time I see something with the animated series on it and I pick it up and I debate as to whether to get it signed or not because I'm looking for the perfect book to get signed well that's because at that time I had already found the perfect book to get signed but I couldn't find a copy of it. I already decided on which one I wanted, but I couldn't find it. Well, finally I found it. And here is the Batman Adventures, the uh, Collector Core Edition, the Legion of Collectors Edition. This was another Loot Crate exclusive. And I found it. So I'm going to get this one signed. This is the book I've been looking to get signed the whole time. I love the Funko Pop aspect of it. I love that it's a classic Batman pose. And inside is a reprint of Batman the Animated Adventures number one. Uh, the one that has Penguin on the cover. Never really cared for that one. Uh, never cared for that cover. Absolutely love this cover. And I'm going to get Kevin Conroy to sign across it. And that's just that's the one. So, so happy to have it. Also, was able to get the Superman version, so I really like that. I love Superman with a curl. Doesn't have the curls, not, hashtag not my Superman. So, <laughs> there's another Legion of Collectors. Very happy to have that. Uh, here's the Amazing Spider-Man 258. Uh, this is the first appearance of the Bagman costume. And uh, this is where the symbiote, they, this is where Spider-Man discovers, well, he, discover, he gets told by Reed Richards of the Fantastic Four that the symbiote costume, that the black costume is actually a symbiote, not just, you know, that it's a sentient being and that it's basically driving him crazy. Um, at that point, you know, Spider-Man just thought it was a really cool suit that had, that had some alien material in it, and that's why it gave him some special abilities. But he was unaware that it was actually a living alien. So that's a pretty cool uh, book to have in my collection. And then the, to top it off, this book, which I had no idea was going to end up in my collection today. Uh, just super happy. Uh, it's Fantastic Four number 105. It's a 15 cent uh, cover. Um, I don't think there's anything hugely significant about this book, but it is a Stan Lee signed copy. You can see that there. And this is also a story written by Stan Lee. So I'm very happy about that because a lot of times you see Stan Lee's signature on anything, which I also appreciate, you know, as long as it says Stan Lee presents on the inside, I think that's a book worthy of getting a Stan Lee signature on it. However, I think the best ones are stories that he was more heavily involved in. So to get this one that was that he wrote uh, signed, I think it's just great. So there it is. 
So that's my quick little uh, comic haul. Hope y'all enjoyed it. And uh, when you get done uh, watching all these uh, little haul videos, I know I crank them out pretty good, uh, but I pick up a lot of books. So, and very, very, very happy to have this set right here. This is one of my favorite uh, comic hauls of the year. Uh, of course, because it has Stanley's signature, but because each of the books in this set really means something to me, and I'm very happy, very, very happy. A lot of them were ones that were on my, uh, well, that, that one right there was on my give up want list. That was on, I, I didn't think I'd get it. I gave up on it um, because they just don't come up for sale very often. Um, and I finally, I found that one, pounced on it, got a great deal on all this. I mean, just a ridiculous deal, basically stole it all. So, which is how uh, I like to buy comics. So, <laughs> all right. Well, uh, when you get done with all this, uh, enjoy this video. I'm going to rewatch it like a hundred times uh, when I'm at work and I don't have these comics in front of me just so I can see them. Uh, all right. When y'all get done, uh, read a comic. Thanks. Bye.